Hey guys, Obsidian Horse here, and we are back for another tutorial video today. I've been getting back in the mood of these, and we are looking at how to build the A5, uh, not the A5C, it's not, not the RA5, the A5, they're different, Vigilant. It um, was a long-range carrier-borne nuclear bomber didn't have any machine guns had but had the capability to f hold a full nuclear war out was a cold war and soldiered on in the air force till the 1991 is when it finally retired this is the single seat a5 we're looking at building there was a larger version the ra5c vigilant which was um was a two seat reconnaissance plane but this version right here is of the bomber. Uh, you can add your own little bomb bay doors and stuff. I didn't. I just keep it clean. It's super easy to build. doesn't take that many blocks. You can see our little nose and our antenna. Just single seat cockpit. Top view of the wings. They were, uh, the wings stopped. They could, I think, maybe the tips of the wings fold up. Yes, they did. The tips of the wings folded up and the tail kind of folded sideways. Not going to show how to build that. I think you guys can figure that out yourself. But yeah, let's look into what blocks we're going to be needing. So the blocks we're going to be needing for this aren't that much. It's kind of the usual amount. Light gray wool, another brick fence, black wool, a button, stone brick slab, another brick slab, glass, stone brick stairs, a pumpkin, another brick stairs, a lever, and light gray carpet. There's only a small amount of those two. Um, text download for this text pack, which is NavyCraft 1.7.10 will be in the description below. If it doesn't work, it'll just bring you to the downloads page, click NavyCraft 1.7.10. That's what this is. But yeah, let's let's la let's launch right into building this. So first you can do is place two light gray wall. On top of that, another brick slab. Delete the light gray wall. Keep the another brick slab. Turn that into two. Then add two black wall, one gray wall. Then you want to put a slab on top of your gray wall and one one glass block behind that. Then we're going to place a gray wall under the glass, a gray wall going out to either side, and a, let me grab our cockpit materials, a lever behind the middle block. Then we can get a slab and start our slab right under the block the lever's on. And just bring that back five. So one, two, three, four, five. After you turn that into five, you can place another brick fence with our black wool for our new nose gear. And then we can bring our light gray wool back even with the landing gear. And then next to the light gray wool, even with the nose gear, you can grab your stone brick stair and place an upside down one facing forward like that. On top of that, you can place a light gray carpet. So those are intakes for our engines in the back. Then, behind this glass right here, one block behind the lever, you can place another brick stair, and then two wool going up, and then cover everything with glass, so it should be three. And on the last glass block, start slabs that will go all the way back. Now we can just fill all this in. And now we're going to be working on our wings, but first this intake, just add two blocks behind that, just bring everything back two except the carpet. The carpet can just stay there and then a bottom slab continued after that. Now once we have this, we're going to do one, two, three, four rows of two starting on this block. So two, two, uh, this, our third of two, our fourth of two, and then do one. Then turn that one into two going this way and then bring everything back. We'll first bring this intake back and then bring everything up to three blocks short of the intake and then move one block in. So it should look something like that. Your wings. Your wing. Let me double check. Two, 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 two. two. Yep, that's what it should look like. And then make sure you have this three block gap going up because the wing does curve back and this is where the fuselage continues back. Now just repeat that exact same pattern on the other side. So this is what your wing pattern should look like. Now once we have that we can bring our forward fuselage section back all the way. 
So let's drag all this stuff back. All our light gray wool. Then cover up this top part. And then these slabs take them all the way back. And then our bottom slab take that all the way back. And you can, if you were to add Bombay doors, they'd be right in the middle of the wings. And now once we hop up here, you can see this is our wing and these metal, middle three blocks put slabs on top of them. So just pause here if you need a reference point, build this. Now I believe it is directly under the well level with this last slab and one block over, so right here, level with the last slab, so you can see that's the last slab, put a nether brick fence and then a button on either side for the rest of our landing gear. So we'll go level with this slab, one block over, so it's, it's going to be right there is where the landing gear is. You place your black wool, your nether brick fence, and a button on either side of this black wool. And now this is what you should be looking at. And now how we have our three blocks going back here. We have our three. This is where we're going to start our tail. Let's just bump out one and continue everything again. And now let me look at our tail design. We'll work on doing that. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over here. We're going to go out two. Then we're going to go out one. And then go back two. And go back two again. And then go back two again. And then have one. So your tail should look go two, um, from this way, three. Then one block up and over, three, three. So that's your tail should look like. Just pause there. Now repeat that on the other side. So now that we have all this, we're going to bring everything back to this last wool. Not the last wool on the tail, but the one right before that. So it should look like that. And bring everything back. Ba boom. Ba boom. And now right here, we're going to put pumpkins for our engines. So we're going to go out like this with our slabs. So you can place it and then delete those slabs. And also for the engines, you do right next behind the pumpkin. Sorry, my friend was calling me on Steam for some reason. Um, right here behind this engine, you want to go one, two, three. I'm pretty sure it's three. Let me check. Yeah, so you do three slabs behind the engine. And then from back here, delete those two. So it should look like that. And, we, and then we can do like some bottom down. But it looks, it shows, it looks really cool from up here. It looks like the real thing a lot. <laughs> now that we have this, back here we're going to build, grab our stair. And place the stair right upside down on this last wool. And then also we can grab, put a slab there. One block up from the last slab and one over. So pause here for reference. Okay, now that we're down here, we can work on doing our tail. So we're going off this last stair. We're going to add one, two, three. Then one, two, one, two, one. And then do stair, slab, slab. So skipping this block right here, and your tail should look something like that. And yeah, that's actually it for how to build the A5 Vigilant. It's a... Cold War era kind of um, carrier-borne nuclear bomber. Hope you all like this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel to see more just cool tutorials on how to build bombers and fighters like this, more Thunder Let's Plays, and Minecraft Let's Plays. See you all later, and I'll catch you in the next one.